Alabama college student used her love of art to show support for former President Donald Trump ahead of the presidential debate this week. But police in DeKalb County say someone burned her yard work to the ground. And uh, WAAY's Rob Sneed shares what the student plans to do next. From this. Beautiful is a good way to put it, but it was just nice. To this. That's unbelievable. There's no freedom of speech left, I guess. Nathan Smith used to enjoy driving by this art display that supported former President Donald Trump along Highway 75 in Savannah. It's been up since August until someone burned it to the ground. I was just shocked that someone would actually do that from around Sylvania. Maddie Smith says she built this display because she wanted to make someone's day. The display on her family's property. I would want to know why, first of all, and would they want someone to do that to them, have their property burned? But the question right now, who did it? DeKalb County investigators are helping police in this investigation, and right now, there is no suspect description. But whoever did this crime could face criminal mischief charges. Both Maddie and Nathan says folks should be able to show their support for any politician without being targeted. I, did, I guess people just have different views than everyone else. And if you have different views, then they judge you for that or they hate you for that. No, you get judged either either side, though. It's not just one side of thing. You get judged on either side. So She says she's going to build an even bigger display. There will be a lot more cameras on this one. So, I mean, if they want to burn it down again, I'll just rebuild it again. And that was Rob Sneed reporting. According to WAAY-TV, Maddie's family is offering a $1,000 reward for any information that could lead to an arrest.